KCOY CBS 12 News. Cal Poly engineering students have officially made it into space. Well, at least their work has. Two of their satellites, or CubeSats, were launched last night, and almost 12 hours later, the students tracked the satellites as they flew over the Cal Poly campus. KCOY CBS 12's Evelyn Tapp joins us now with more on the CubeSats travels. Evelyn. Drew, Cal Poly's CubeSat team was extremely excited to see their mission succeed. They participated in a similar launch last year, but unfortunately, the rocket holding their CubeSats didn't make it to orbit. But today, it was a different story. After a sleepless night, the Cal Poly CubeSat team anxiously awaits for their satellite to pass overhead. We can make the electronics here in the lab, which is a lot of fun, a lot of learning experience. But what happened last night was we actually got the satellites in space. The rocket launched Monday night at the Bakunor Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. Before the launch, students worked day and night to make it happen. First, the team had to build small CubeSats, basically mini satellites, then put the hardware inside. That's developed by other companies aiming to test their products in space. Cell phone and MP3 components are an example of just a few things they can put inside. Upon completion, students took the final product to Russia just a few weeks ago. Once we got to Baikonur, our responsibility was to um, verify that the hardware had survived the trip over because we carried it as a uh, hand baggage onto the airplanes. After securing the cubes into a pea pod and onto the rocket, they returned home to await the big day. As they stand by, they explain. The satellites, yes, come out of here like a simple jack-in-the-box, and then they end up being in orbit around the Earth. Okay. And that's kind of the ground track up there of where the satellites will be. And so they should be passing over us in the next 20 minutes or so. Okay. The time passes, and the team hears static. <laughs> but no sound from the CubeSat. About an hour and a half later, it comes back. But this time... Oh, there it is. They hear it, but just for a few seconds. Pleased with the result, the team breathes a sigh of relief. Now that we have a better idea of where we're supposed to be pointing, and then hopefully we can get some better positions from, say, NORAD, and uh, finally we can, might be able to make contact and uh, get some health status of it and start some operations. So. Okay. The CubeSat will orbit over the Central Coast again at about 10 p.m. tonight. Evelyn Taft, KCOY, CBS 12. All right. Well, the Cal Poly SAT project was founded in 1999 and involves a team of undergraduate and graduate engineering students.